Ohio law enforcement now have a new tool to try to catch people who injure or even kill an officer, and you may well be able to help. Jackie Sprague, live with the new law that takes effect today. Jackie? Ohio is the 15th state to implement the Blue Alert program. It's a way for law enforcement to reach out to the community when an officer is missing, hurt, or killed and calls on them for help. The quicker we can respond, we have a greater chance of saving a life. Losing a deputy in the line of duty is a tragedy the Clark County Sheriff's Office is all too familiar with. On New Year's Day 2011, Deputy Suzanne Hopper was shot and killed while responding to a shots fired call at the Enon Beach Mobile Home Park in Clark County. Sheriff Gene Kelly was there the day his colleague was killed, and he hopes the state's new Blue Alert program will help prevent more tragedies like this. A Blue Alert will be issued if a law enforcement officer is killed, is missing, or if they are seriously injured, and if the law enforcement agency investigating has sufficient information about a suspect, a suspect vehicle, license plate numbers. That information will then activate a toll-free tip line, a media blast, a statewide message to all troopers, an entry into the state's license plate recognition system, postings on the state's electronic highway signs, and a radio broadcast to law enforcement. The quicker we can get that information out, not only to law enforcement, but using the help of media, putting it across the bottom of television screens. We're enlisting potentially 11 million additional people to be on the lookout. Greene County Sheriff Gene Fisher says this new alert system could have been used in May 2011 when Warren County Sheriff Deputy Sergeant Brian Dooley was killed. Sergeant Dooley was laying down stop sticks when he was struck and killed by the suspect's car during a police chase. The suspect fled the scene and after an air and ground search, police finally found him. With this of a system and, and the technology that's available, the, the public in Warren County could have been advised and you know there's a lot of information flowing anyway, but um, all the avenues of information sharing could have been applied to the Blue Alert system to let everybody know to be on the lookout for this person. Now the second phase of the Ohio Blue Alert will go into effect in mid-June. The system will then be able to send notifications to the public through the Truckers Alert Activation System, Facebook, Twitter, and text message. Reporting live, Jackie Sprague, 2 News.